Hi, this is Hope. Welcome to my channel where I aspire to inspire and motivate you by sharing what inspires and motivates me. All right, here is my newly cleaned and upgraded pastel storage system. I have a previous video on it that I will put a card in above and link it down below if you'd like to take a look at that. And before I get too much farther, I want to make a correction to that video. Originally, I had bought two two-tier Sterilite brand stack and store uh, carry things. I think in that first video I said I got one four tier, but that's incorrect. They were two two tiers. Now, the problem with it, even that is this particular configuration is no longer for sale, which is sad because I wanted to go back and get more of them. But they do have a smaller and a larger version. One of them is a three tray and the top tray is deeper. So you could put more uh, individual trays inside that if you wanted. Either way, take a look what's available and you can adapt what I've done to whatever size you end up with. Let me show you the two upgrades that I've done to the insides of this. First is these little tabs here. A viewer on the, pr the first video had the idea of little pull tabs on top to help you facilitate grabbing the trays out and it really does make it a lot easier that along with the stiffer cardboard in the bottom makes these so much more stable and um, just easier to work with which is uh, definitely a big bonus on this and I've done that to almost all of them the bottom tray I have not upgraded yet and I'll show you let me see if I can, yeah, you can see this I would have to reach in and kind of grab with my thumbs and you can see how that just kind of starts to taco. You can see how flexible that is. Whereas the upgraded one, nice and stiff. So much, much easier. Not that this was impossible. I obviously went many years with it this way, just fine with no mishaps. So up to you, whichever version you choose. Um, you could, since this is, you could, if you wanted, instead of doing two layers, the cereal box bottom and the pizza cardboard <laughs> bottom, instead of both of those, you could do just one. But the good thing about ha you having two layers on the bottom is that it gives you a place to glue this in between. And I will give you more information on that in an upcoming video where I walk you through making one of these trays. It's not that hard, but sometimes it's easier to show than it is to tell, right? All right, let me stack this back on and I will show you the final upgrade. And uh, while I'm doing this, I will explain that the reason I made a carry bag for this is that a couple years ago, I'm coming home from class, teaching downtown. And as I'm carrying this, it did have two really thick bands of heavy elastic that I thought would be enough to keep together should there be a failure. But I was thinking like, you know, this would break. Well, this, one of these caught on my pant leg, popped off, the whole thing spilled out all over the sidewalk. Not the whole thing, I'm sorry, just a couple trays spilled onto the sidewalk, which was devastating enough because several of them were just kind of disintegrating the process. The good news is, as I looked down on the carnage, um, I noticed the leaves on the sidewalk and the prints they had left after the rain. And so ended up being inspired to paint this painting here. So, you know, it is it is what it is, but let's not do it again. So here is my upcycled storage bag that has been, ooh, let's not, let's not spill it right here. Make sure that's all together. And this lowers right into that bag and I can carry it wherever I need to. This bag is recycled from a black oil sunflower seed bag that I got at, I think it was Tractor Supply. This is their brand, I believe. But any old, you know, woven plastic seed bag will do. Or you could use fabric or whatever. You've got a pair of old jeans. Make yourself a bag. In a future video, I will go through how I made this so that you can make one too. 
This video update was made possible by my patrons on Patreon. The link is in the description below. Please check it out for more information and consider joining one of my teams.